talking about the 90% of life. There's a lot of, uh, there's one of the great mysteries of, in science today is, uh, what is what is dark matter? Uh, in dark matter, we, we, we've seen that it, it, it's 90% it, of what is out there is made of dark matter and energy. Uh, they, they know that that exists because it has the gravitational field that something exists. So what we experience in, in, in our daily lives is really only, uh, you know, 4 to 10 percent of what is. So between uh, yourself and, and, and your computer screen that you're looking at right now, there's 90 percent more energy and space and, and frequency and, uh, and beings, perhaps, uh, you know, that, that, that exists in that, in that little space between your eye and the screen. So there's more of the world than, than we perceive. Now this 90% can be followed throughout, throughout uh, other, other uh, conditions in our, for instance, there's approximately 90, the world is made up of, the surface of the planet is made up of approximately 90% water. And uh, our bodies are made of approximately 90% water. And our brains, we only use 10% uh, 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 at the most of our brains and the rest is made up of this stuff called uh, glia cells which uh, comprise 90% of, of our brains. And uh, our DNA, in our DNA, we, we only use uh, uh, like 4% of our DNA, and everything else is junk DNA. And this, uh, the, the scientists uh, have discovered that there's a kind of language that exists within this, this uh, junk DNA. And uh, uh, ayahuascaros, the shamans of, uh, of uh, South America, uh, tune into this, this 90%. And this is where they, they get the information for healing, healing herbs and such. So there's, there's a great deal of mystery in this, you know, what is this 90%? But uh, the 90% could be, um, you know, in, in my mind, many things, but it's, it's a quantum field. It's a field that's uh, perhaps populated by aliens and, and uh, fairies and our ancestors and ghosts and... Uh, God's imagination is, is limitless. I, I, I feel that, that if we can imagine it, certainly God has imagined it, and it, it exists. And but so so this this ninety percent allows for multiple uh, parallel worlds to exist in the same place. So we're we're in this in this life, this glorious uh, amnesia, where we. Um, where we live in our four percent of reality and think it's the whole the whole picture, and uh, freedom freedom comes. Uh, uh, the the I, I really feel that that uh, consciousness comes when uh, and, and and the ascension happens, uh, the rapture happens, when we as as a as a human spirit and entity and energy and piece of reality can experience this other 90%. Now, uh, a DNA strand, each, each cell has uh, three meters of uh, DNA wrapped up in it. So if you, if you combine all the cells of our body and stretch that DNA out, we have 125 million miles of DNA wrapped up in our bodies. So if you take 90% of this, that's still 100 million miles of DNA that's full of language and connection and, and uh, you know, we do live in that 90 percentile. Our, we have DNA that's in our body, the 90 percent DNA, the 90% the of the water uh, is living in this 90 percent of, of the world's energy, of, of the universe's energy. So if we can open ourselves up to this 90 percent, boy, that's, that would really be something.